And a wonderful curator, Leda. Uh -huh. And we would be here without her, but uh, Brazilian art is, is really uh, needs to be exposed. Yeah. And Macy's can do it. It's amazing that you say that because we took a look at all the artwork that you have here in this excerpt of Wardnas Gallery here in yeah. Macy's, and we've seen so uh, such a huge diversity. How do you deal with that? Because Brazil is a huge country; we have a little bit of everything. That's right. There's, there's, it's hard to say that it's just Brazilian, because it's just great art, you know. It's not necessarily Brazilian, but our gallery shows thousands of artists, we have thousands of members, and we sell or we, our audience is the general public. So it's a great combination, mm -hmm. Warden Essie Gallery and Macy's. And I, I just hope we can continue that relationship. Macy's used to uh, sell and uh, show art mm -hmm. uh, in the old days when I was that high. <laughs> but. Uh, but uh, they should go back to it, you know? And it's so exciting. Yeah. It's so uh, uh, refreshing, yeah. refreshing. It's lively. When you come here and you see all this art and you know, it's like you don't even have to go to a gallery anymore. And it brings also art you know, to people there's that- There's something about galleries that uh, intimidate people. Not everybody. Uh, we'll walk into a, an art gallery, especially if it's a one-person show. But uh, Macy, everybody goes to Macy's, and they should see art. You know, people were coming in and, and touching the art, and I didn't mind so much because it's their first time experience with original art, and, and they were buying it. That's great. Thank you so much. It was a pleasure talking to you.